Ruth here, and this is my Crafter's Companion Craft Supplies Haul number 28, I believe. I think. Okay, so it's got lots of stuff in here. Got lots of stuff. She can't see. But I think we'll just put it on the table, I guess, because I don't have any table space, so I don't do that, I guess. Okay, so <clears throat> we got stuff in here. It's our ink pads, which they tend to just put the ink pads in a little mailer or something, I guess, so it doesn't leak or anything. We have this thing here, which I can't quite remember what it is. I think I am. But I don't really know. We got die set, die set, die set, and a stamp set. We got a kit and a paper pad thing. Okay, so let me just plop this here. Hopefully it won't fall. We just gotta go wait to this one. And okay, let me just shove this on the floor. At least it's Wednesday, so it's gonna be recycling taking out tomorrow as I don't have any really no second boxes full. Anyway, we have a multi-sheet paper pad, 12 days of Christmas, 36 piece, th uh, one, 12 by 12, 180 GSM. This was on sale <coughs> for, where is, ah, oh, here, £4.49 instead of, I think, the $14.99 it's supposed to be, I think. Um, I guess I can show it to you first. Oh yes, this is the card kit, this one. It's got, it's got a code on the side. Um, <clears throat> let me open the thing there, this pad. You can get it. Put it that way. That way. I mean, I guess I might be able to take it off, but I don't want to have the top of the pad stick in, stick up in this. So just cut it and the tape it back down. Alright, so here's the uh, 12 beautifully illustrated and double sided designs. And the code is here. And here's the back of one. Very pretty. Some Christmas baubles and I think pancettias and snowflakes. So three of each design is it, I guess maybe. Mm. Two. Three. I guess. Yeah. This is just you know, acid and a L I G N I N free. I'm not sure what that is. No, it is. I don't know what the other thing is. Lignin free. Mm. Well, anyway, this is not a pearlescent card. It's just you know plain matte. That's pretty one. I guess that goes by the song. 
Because obviously 12 days is Christmas. One thing for each. Is it? Mm, yeah. So that's this one. Um, I'll do the things that are already out first. Hmm. It doesn't have a thing on it. Like a barcode on the outside. But anyway. <coughs> we have a just for you two piece die. So it's um you know the as you can sort of see the words and then the shadow. Like that. Then we have this lovely Mermaid Kisses 8 piece stamp set. We got one mermaid, starfish, then two sentiments, and a seahorse, and a mermaid, and I guess coral, coral there is a silhouette by some uh, air bubbles or whatever, so as well. Um, mermaid Kisses and Starfish Wishes, and have a fantastic day. Well, that was nice, because like the other mermaid stamps in the Enchanted Ocean collection have like scales going all the way up. So I thought it would be nice to for a different design. But that, I guess, is old because I, I was really dusty or whatever that was. I have to wash my hands after this. Okay, I mean, this is very old, granted. This is. 2020. Hmm. It is four years old. Okay, now this is a lovely Wisteria Collection Nature's Garden. I guess that's the entire collection and Wisteria Collection is like a sub-collection. Um, ornate Window. So I thought that would be good, because I don't really have any window uh, dies. I've got a cut and emboss window embossing folder, but I don't have a window die. So I was been meaning to get one, and this one was on sale. I forgot to tell the prices of the other ones. <clears throat> okay, the Just For You is £1.79. The ornate window is £2.39. And the mermaid kisses stamp set is £1.49. These are all on sale, by the way. Um, yes, and the die that I'm holding that I'm about to get to is £7.49. And that is the reveal setup. Okay, you can't hear this screaming, screaming outside. Hopefully you can't because I do have a microphone on. So it should be noise canceling for our things. Anyway, make your handmade cards and gifts stand out from the crowd with our fabulous reveal window stamp and die set. Perfect for all occasions. So it should be interesting. Okay. You know, like it has a pull me, it's got some lines, so, like letters, and a bird holding it, and some hearts, and uh, just a note to say. Yes, can you see that? There you go. And the uh, largest die is 3.7 by 9.9. .9. This is Dusty too. How old is this? 2021. Oh. It is real dusty. Okay, that's really dirty. 
Let me just... I'm definitely going to need to wash something. Look how dusty that. I don't really want to knock on my on my desk, so just general wipey wipe. Ooh, this one's older. This is just for you guys. 2019. No, she's not older. <laughs> the 20... 2020 and the 2021 is older. I can't count. But this is old. So old. Okay. I mean, it's really dusty. It's not even in there. Um, warehouse for a while. Okay. Thing, so I'm lifting it up. This <clears throat> is what I'm about to open. Is seven pound forty nine as well, and this is slightly different from what I bought. This can't go out. Oh, there it is. Popped right out. That's good. Well, this is a nice spin box. So. Okay, this is the Scratch and Reveal card making kit. Make a minimum of 12 cards. Includes over 150 elements. Box includes 12 card blanks, 12 envelopes, 12 colored card, 57 Scratch and Reveal stickers, 12 printed papers, and 55 clear acrylic stamps. Here is this. Come on. Focus. So it looks like I should probably show you what stamps it is. Oops. Just make sure it's all okay. So we got the uh, card and envelope. We got oh, this is the printed paper, and this is the card stock. Twelve colored card is this one. And the printed papers is this one, I guess. Should I open it? Or something? It? Oh yes. Also has it written right here. Hmm. This is very nice. It's like on the cover. This looks like um kind of similar to like alcohol ink splodges. That's like on the box. Looks like it's a tool each. Very pretty. Oh, you got some wooden bits. Can't think of the word. Some more inky looking things and more wooden. Well, I don't know if the word plank is right. It looks like wooden floor. And that's pretty nice. Those ones. Okay. 
I guess I'll uh, show this one. Colored card, as it says right here. So which colors are they under? No point taking it all out. It's got a peachy color. I'm not really sure what that color is. Kind of brownish, grayish, orange kind of color, minty green. Got some less. Maybe that's all green. That's minty green. Kind of bluish color. Yeah, those. Then. You have the scratch and reveal stickers. Then, the stamps. That's a lot of stamps. Okay. You got a lot here. Got a baby and then a, and a wrap thing. You got a champagne with cork coming out, a heart, present box, suitcases, a diamond ring. Excuse me. Um, the only thing better than having you as my dad. Blah, blah, blah. I couldn't decide what to get for your birthday. For some reason, that's that kind of kind of funny. Put that, and you, then you put. This, in this under a scratch reveal sticker. <laughs> and like leading up to that, kind of some birthday present to drop. Uh, let's celebrate in style. You got an arrow, date night, surprise, lotto, scratch the heart for a special surprise, scratch here to reveal, he or she, scratch here to see, or well, scratch to see, cross echo. I guess you could stamp it on the Champagne glass. I don't know. This surprise is better than Prosecco. Night away. Save the date. Scratch and match three to reveal your gift. Oh, baby. There's this baby in your heart there. You know, more sentiments over here. Um, let's see. The only thing better than having you as my best friend. Da da da. Scratch to reveal your surprise, a kind of globe bit, and a, a movie uh, action thing. Um, are you feeling lucky? Scratch to win. Roses are red, violets are blue. Scratch the heart to see what I got for you. That's a nice one. A friend like you deserves. When you wish upon a star. Uh, we're excited to tell you. Scratch to reveal your birthday treat. Scratch here. Pack your bags. Breakfast in bed. Movie night. Happy birthday. Join me on an adventure. Scratch to reveal where. Guess what? With love on your special day. Wishing you a very happy birthday. An arrow. Wishing you a very... I love you. It's a boy. It's a girl. Psst. Do you want to know a secret? It's your birthday, let's celebrate. Drinks on you. I simply wanted to say... Did I say guess what? Can't remember. Um, there's a heart. Drinks on me. Spa day. Surprise. I think I said them all now. So yes, those are the stamps. Which is good. Because I sort of did have to look and see. So I got the three mini kits, but I didn't have these ones because so I wanted to make sure they were different, you know. So I did ask, they weren't sure, but uh, I sort of looked at the previous picture I took when I had those, and I thought I had, you know, I didn't have these ones, so I I got it, hoping I did get something different, and I did. Yay. Okay, so... Okay. 
Now, I'll do this last. Should I do this last? Because this is the kit. And it doesn't have the knit. Oh, yes, it does. So it seems craft kit. Is this? I guess it says a kit 54 on the code, so that's the 54th one of this. And that is 20 pounds. And here is 45. In total, after all the discounts and everything, it was a 72.12. And these. Oh, this time they actually sealed it shut. Last time they never did, and I was able to reuse the envelope. But oh well. I thought. It was a good opportunity to get these, because I don't have these ones in my collection. And if you remember previous haul, I got the pigment ink pad set. And these ones I thought would be a nice addition for my ink pads, because I didn't have the set. And these ones are I guess navy blue, or what color would you say? Like a turquoise navy blue, blue green kind of. Because yeah. like the uh, pigment ones are like a wine blood red kind of color, verging on brown. These are the opaque pigments. These are the water reactives. So, at least, it's kind of nice for them to make them in different colors, so you know which ink pads it is. So, this. You got Straw Bale. Then you have an Upside Down Lemon Tonic. Then you have some more Upside Down ones. Um, you got a Fuchsia. Then you have Pink Tulip. Then you have Pine Tree. If I mean see. Then you've got Orange. Oops. Then you've got Oasis. Pale Fig. Chinese red, an upside down crushed violet, velvet, can't read, and a grasshopper. And if you want to read, slow drying and water react soluble for a range of layered blended effects and coordinated colors that will combine beautifully. The rest of the other language. So like, that's the uh, code. So I think the only difference in code... Let's see... So it's got HWR, so I'm guessing for Harmony Water Reactive. Then... It's got a bit of uh, the title of the, the name, you know, of the uh, thing. Ink pad, that's the word. Um, let's see, that's purple. We normally put the pink on top, don't we? On the bottom, right? Ah, oh, there it is. Here it is. That's a pink purple. Purple. It goes light to dark, so. Though if you do it like this, you can't really see color, you know, in the middle very well. But anyway, this goes like this. What goes after that? Blue. 
wish there was another blue as well because they got a light and dark of other colors, just not, you know? So for instance, you know, those you know, pine trees are darker, and it goes grasshopper, and you got lemon tonic, straw bale, orange, Chinese red. Rainbow colors. I wish they had another blue though, like a darker blue, like midnight or something, to go with the scent. So that is the ink pads. Now here is the kit. This is it. Yeah. That is the back side. Here is the top. So it seems craft kit makes a minimum of 18 6x6 cards over 220 elements. It's very nice and graphic. Purple on the sides. I mean, if I keep it in the box, I have a in the storage box to keep it. Welcome to Silhouette Scenes Craft Kit, brought to you by Crafters Companion with over 220 individual elements inside, including 15 clear acrylic stamps, 9 satin ribbons, and much more. You'll be able to make a minimum of 18 high quality cards. This complete kit is perfect for all levels of crafting ability and is a great way to expand or develop your crafting techniques with ease. Lux includes <laughs> two metal dies, 15 acrylic stamps, seven plastic stencils and masks, nine pieces satin ribbon, 18 card blanks and envelopes, each 18 cardstock panels, 100 piece dewdrops, an 18 piece colored card pack, and 18 piece printed paper. So, pattern paper, I guess. So, let's see. You know, this was lifting up, lift up. Here we go. I'll just put that over there. I'll keep the sticker. Ooh, we've got a uh, want to know more or full instructions. Visit crafterscompanionbox.com. See? Okay, so we got a little uh, welcome to your new project kit. A little intro thing from Zara. I'm sure you'll have hours of endless fun using this fabulous kit, whether by yourself or around the table with your family. Don't forget to check out the dedicated online page showcasing how to get the most from your new purchase. On there, you'll find lots of video content, technique ideas, and also some great gallery inspiration showing what you can make using components including in included in this box. We'd love to see your creations using your kit, so please share your images on our Facebook page. Here's a thank you for your purchase. Be sure to visit the site. Very lovely Crafters Companion tissue. And it's all packaged up. How cute. And it says what it is. Two drops. <clears throat> I 
You know, this is not very productive. Let me get my big ones. Be so much easier to cut with walkers. Mm -hmm. No. But, never mind that for a sec. The dewdrops. Very nice. It's also, I guess, this is all packaged in this. And uh, sustainable packaging. And it's all cardboard, not plastic. Very nice, very nice. Then we've got metal dies. I wonder what they are. Ah, hello and with love. Very nice words. Stencils and masks. So like a hill. He got Storm is like a sun and clouds. And like the mask is uh, like a little cloud here that fell out. And this those uh, went in there. And The other cloud and sun or circle. A very pretty heart with a ribbon on it. Okay. I can get this back in, would be nice. <laughs> Though there is no heart. Or a ribbon mask. So, I wonder why. I mean, he's got the mask and stencil for everything else, just not the heart of ribbon. Hmm. Anyway, so that's that. We got sorted ribbon. Let's see what this is. in three different sizes. Very nice. Like a pink kind of, and like a blue-green peely kind of color and purple. I'm not sure it's like a cross between a pink and a peach. Oh, I don't know. Then we have clear stamps. Oh, we've got two lots. So we've got some sentiments. Just for you, follow your dreams, happy birthday, with love, make a wish, and enjoy your special day. You know, I think I have just for you quite a few times now. And I was love, uh, like two make a wish or three. Quite a lot of happy birthdays now. Anyway, excuse me. We got some silhouette. It says this is a silhouette kit. We got a tree. We got a girl on a swing. Got a male and female in a dress. Well, the male's not in a dress. The female is obviously. As you can see. We got a uh, male and female. One like holding the other one. A fairy bunny. Grass, 
and some, you know, just grass sticking up too. Uh, did I say butterfly? I can't remember. And some, I have no idea, some plant of some kind. So those are the stamps. Very nice, very nice. Next up, cardstock panels. Okay, smooth, like our song. I mean, I'll see if you can out me. I believe this goes with the um, card and envelope bits because they're, I believe, 6x6, six six, maybe? Card blank. It is kind of obvious. You know. The envelope should also be obvious. Six. Okay, then we've got printed paper and colored card. Now let me just put the card stock card and envelope ones back in there. The colored, like a salmon color. That reminds me of that straw bale color, I think. Very vibrant. Whatever that color is. Okay, so it's those colors. Ooh, isn't that a pretty sunset kind of color? Or it could be the ocean and the sand. Three of each color, of each paper, I guess. It's a lovely blue. Ooh, very nice nighttime scene, this one. Very pretty. I like that one. Ooh, that's very pretty as well. Pink and purple. Some pink clouds. And this is like a sunset kind of thing. Ooh, some very nice galaxy kind of pink, blue, purple. Very nice. It's nice to do three of each. There you go, that shows everything. Well, it's a nice haul, this one. Haul number 28. Sorry, my... My armrest on this chair has is, gone is wonky again. Um, anyway. Yes, I think I said it here a lot. Anywho! <laughs> um, yes. So excited. This is for obviously Christmas cards. I'm excited to see what that will look like. It's too bad. It doesn't come with like that as a die. And just as an just as a uh, stencil on the inside instead of just the outside. You know, you know what I'm saying? 
It's not a mask, just a sense of Unfortunate. Be nice to be a king of this tent. A mask as well. Whatever. Um, that things. <sighs> Lovely mermaid. That's what we do. And the window. Well, anyway, yes, I'm just gonna repeat myself one time. So I'm looking forward to making something. I keep on getting distracted. And just doing organizing and stuff, then making stuff, but technically yesterday I had this box on my desk so I couldn't actually do anything, but yes, I need to sort these, swatch them, put them away. I'm thinking of rearranging where I have my ink pads because they're over there and I have to get up every time I want to use them. So I think maybe putting them on my desk somewhere and moving one of the things I don't use as much from my desk to over there because, you know, I'd give me space. But yes, anyway, much easier to get the ink pads when they're on my desk instead of over there. This is my thought. Anyway. Why well, do you say enemy a lot in this one, I? I didn't quite notice that. Anyway, hmm. Okay, so thank you for watching. Over and out.